Short-Term Missions provides a unique opportunity for local churches to intentionally engage the lost in a cross-cultural and often churchless context. When churches send short-term missions teams, they offer a practical outlet for people to engage in intense evangelism and discipleship activity. The intensity of the evangelism and discipleship activity is often difficult to replicate at home and the opportunity to be freed up from normal daily responsibilities to intentionally engage in service, evangelism, and discipleship is one of the great benefits of short-term trips. It's one thing for us to hear about the Great Commission and be challenged as believers to go and make disciples of all nations, but it is an entirely different thing for us to get on a plane and to travel to an unreached or unfamiliar place to encounter people who have never heard of Jesus and then actually share the gospel with them. Going on a short-term trip exposes us to the realities of the lostness around the world in a way that no video, no book, and no pamphlet could ever accomplish. Because the reality is that we really have no idea what we don't know. Dave Beauclair, the Moose Jaw Victory Church missions representative says, I love both local and international missions. I believe we are missionaries in the cities that we live in, the jobs that we work, and the places that we shop. Yet international missions, seeing and experiencing different cultures, has a way of widening your perspective. In many short-term missions trips, you see and experience things that you never would in your own city. You gain an understanding of the ownership that you have in the gospel moving forward, and your passion for the lost is dramatically deepened. People who are passionate about reaching the lost grow churches. Being a part of a short-term missions trip benefits everyone. It benefits the mission, it benefits the person going on the trip, and most of all, the church sending them on the trip, who later receives them back with a renewed passion for the lost.